Whoa! This, these explosions going on, go. there's just cars but abandoned just being left there. Alright, here's the, is this the truck? I think this is the truck he was talking about. They're like zombies coming at me. So chaotic right now. What a beautiful day it is here in Los Santos. The current time is 8.05 a.m. And today is purge day. So, what we need to do is we need to stock up on weapons. We also need to make sure that Chop is okay. How is Chop? Let's go out and see how he is. There's Chop. Hey Chop, how you doing fella? So I, I can't take you out for what today. Danny's gonna go get some supplies and stuff. Ready for the purge tonight. Now if you don't know what the purge is, the purge is it's one day, one night of the year where all crime is legalized for 12 continuous hours there should be an announcement right before seven o'clock tonight uh that will that will play on the tv so uh important so we better go get supplies while we can as you can see i have no weapons so we need to supply on some weapons i have thirty thousand dollars in the budget let's go to the gun store and buy some guns while we can so we've got six hours to go get guns now obviously i think that it will be busy uh there doesn't seem to be many people on the streets probably because everyone's getting ready to go to the purge or people are out while they still can also i do apologize if i do sound a bit not right because i'm not feeling a bit right um a bit ill i apologize if i don't sound normal yeah, there's a few people well maybe they're all going to get supplies or they're going to get guns um ready for tonight so we're ne nearly at the gun store the gun store what i'm also thinking is maybe getting maybe some wood or something just to border up the windows but i already have an outfit set ready for tonight so if i do go purging i'll be all good and i'm also thinking maybe go checking out michael before we go back home um, hopefully these people have hopefully the simulation has stock thank goodness you have stock okay so we do we've already got thirty thousand dollars we need to buy obviously we need to buy a carbon rifle uh, i'm probably not gonna put upgrades on it obviously we don't probably don't need suppressors but um let me just buy a few rounds don't you just want to shoot those gun law protesters in the face now we do want to be prepared because the purge is crazy. I have no idea why I bought that, but okay. Let's just buy some heavy utility weapons. We should be okay with those. Obviously we will need a pistol, so let's get those uh, extended clip. Maybe a flashlight? Uh, let's buy an AK-47 as well, uh, just to be sure. Let's buy a few rounds. Uh, should we get a shotgun? Buy an a micro SMG. I don't think I'm gonna use all these weapons tonight. Okay, so I bought myself a, a machete and I bought myself a knife. Now I do think we should buy some grenades because we may need them for. I'm gonna go buy a few. Maybe a sticky bomb. And then I also bought the um, pistol five, uh, five, five millimeter. That should be all good. Um. Let's go get some supplies and then we need to, um, I'm gonna go check out Franklin, see how he's doing before we get home ready for the purge. Alright, so let's drive in to the gas station. Hopefully they got supplies. Hello. I'd like to buy some supplies, please. Thank you, sir. Have a nice day. Uh, good luck. So we've got the supplies we needed. Okay, so it's three o'clock at the moment. So let's go and check out Michael, see how he's doing, see if he's ready for the purge or not. Um, so I've got my supplies, we're ready to go. Uh, I got the guns that I needed. Lucky they were open. Oh. Okay, so it looks like Franklin... Uh, it already looks like Michael's all ready to go. You boys ready for the purge? Uh, Michael looks like he has a lot of security. Well, there's a lot of security out here. Um, well, if he's a wealthy man, then yeah. Excuse me, sir. I'm here to see Michael DeSanta. So there's guards everywhere. Michael and his family doesn't seem to be home. Maybe that he's already out getting supplies while he still can. Yeah, it looks like Michael's probably getting ready for the purge as well. So he might be going out doing purging. And I think Trevor also might be doing it as well. We need to get back because it is nearly 5pm. Hey, we are back home. I think Chop will be okay. Hey Chop, hey Chop. Sorry, I can't take you off a walk now. The purge starts in about an hour. So we do have to be ready. Let's actually bring Chop in just to be on the safe side. Okay, so the purge is gonna start very soon um i'm gonna start getting ready uh, i'll get my outfit on and yeah hope and then the news will start so all right so this is my outfit i know it's basic but we've got a mask to cover our face we've got a jacket to keep us warm as well because it's gonna probably get cold got some jeans i've got some shoes this is a really fake head now the purge is gonna be starting in about less than half an hour so we 
Do we have to be cautious? Do we, do we have to be calm? Chops wandered off somewhere. I don't know where he is. Let's turn the TV on. Let's sit on the couch and let's watch the TV, shall we? News 13 wishes anyone who is not participating in this year's purge a safe evening. And for those releasing the beast, a successful cleanse. Good luck. <laughs> This is not a test. This is your emergency broadcast system announcing the commencement of the annual purge sanctioned by the U.S. government. Weapons of class 4 and lower have been authorized for use during the purge. All other weapons are restricted. Government officials of ranking 10 have been granted immunity from the purge and shall not be harmed. Commencing at the siren, any and all crime, including murder, will be legal for 12 continuous hours. Police, fire, and emergency medical services will be unavailable until tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. when the purge concludes. Blessed be our new founding fathers and America, a nation reborn. May God be with you all. There we go. The purge has now started. So the alarms are now going off. Uh, you can hear gunshots going on outside. Somebody killed Chop. No. Okay, there's somebody over there. There we go. Okay, I think our main objective tonight is to get through the night without dying, hopefully. Um, now, it is going to be chaotic, so uh, we do need to be cautious. Oh, you can hear gunshots. You can hear... Going on my bike is probably not a good idea. I do know a place where there is armored vehicles, which we can take. Okay, honestly, hopefully Michael is okay. Um... Whoa, there's so much chaos going on right now. We do have to be super cautious. But um, over in Stamp City, which is over in Sandy Shores here, there was, um, somebody told me that there was armored vehicles and they are keeping it stored there. But the problem is, it is dangerous. Uh, there is gangs and there's explosions going on. Whoa! Everything is going crazy. But yeah, I've got reports... Not reports, but there is rumors that there is armored vehicles there that would be really good for tonight. I just need to make it there. Oh, there's Trevor! Trevor! Okay, so Trevor is out purging, said. Is that a plane? Oh my goodness. Okay, we're going to go on foot. These explosions going on everywhere. There's a plane that's blowing up here. Um, I think we need to go to the highway. Getting out of the highway is probably good. We can sell a vehicle, maybe. Um, give me that vehicle. Give me that vehicle. Give me that vehicle. Someone's shooting at me. There we go. Let's go, 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 go. Let's take this vehicle, maybe? I know it is. <laughs> um, yeah, maybe we can go to Stab City, bring the, get the vehicles, bring them back, and maybe survive. Let's actually set a waypoint. Let's just drive out there. And it's probably better to get out of the city because there's not going to be so much chaos. Um, maybe we can go to the military base, but that is very risky because they could be on high alert because it is purge night, after all. It looks like everybody's out doing the purge tonight. Whoa! That guy nearly ran me over. Not ran me over, but nearly hit into me. Just these explosions going on. There's just cars being abandoned, just being left there. My cars are in not that good shape. Uh, we need to stay away from people because they could have explosives. Alright, so it is starting to get darker, so maybe there's somewhere that we can set up uh, a little bit of a base. Uh, a temporary base just to hold out the purge. Okay, you try to shoot me, so I'll kill you. Yeah, well, okay, so now my vehicles are badly uh, not good damage. Shame. Out of the way! Whoa! My vehicle's in so much damage. I, I'm gonna need to get a new vehicle when I get there. Okay, so he says that there should be a truck. There should be a truck at the far side of the, um, of this thing, whatever it is. Uh, not that truck. There's another truck. And it should be armored. Oh, is there anyone else? Is there anyone else around here? <laughs> that was a stupid idea. Why did I blow myself up? This is another guy there. All right, I am gonna check this area see if there's anyone else. Uh, maybe not. All right, here's the, is this the truck? I think this is the truck he was talking about. This is a cool truck. 
It's got a nice horn. Let's go back to Los Santos. Hopefully this truck will be able to survive. He said there was, um, I think his name was Frank. He said there was like five, there was like three vehicles. There was this one and then there was like two others, but I'm guessing that the other people might have took it. He said that they may not all wait, they may not all be there. Oh, there's even a flamethrower. Yeah, he told me that there's a flamethrower as well. We've got another seven hours before the project is over. Burn. 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 Okay, so I've had this vehicle for quite a bit now. It's held up, it's held up pretty well actually. It is 4 7 a.m. Hey, you try to blow me up, I'll blow you up. You can catch on fire. About two to three hours before the purge is finished. They're like zombies coming at me. There we go. The number one god. You move behind me. There we go. Here's. I've managed to make my way around Los Santos without taking too much damage. Those are compact grenade launchers. I can see the sun is coming out. It's nearly six o'clock. It's nearly an hour. I oh, I need to get out. I need to move. Run this guy over. Run this. Go, go, go. It's so chaotic right now. Oh, my vehicle's gonna explode. Oh, hi, lady. That was crazy. It's been, we've, it's been crazy tonight. Hello, lady. Okay, so I think we can get through the night. Just a few more minutes. And then we should, the purge should have ended. There's explosions going on. There's, it's crazy right now. There we go. Okay, there we go. The purge is now finished. It is seven o'clock in the morning. We made it. Look at all the dead, all the bodies that's happened. It's crazy. Obviously the purge is over, so all crime is now uh, illegal. Or illegal. So this will mean I have to call a taxi, because I can't steal a car. I guess the game is called Grand Theft Auto, but hopefully Chopper's okay. My house, please. Fine with you. Your thing, man. There's police now, there's... You can hear sirens, you can hear the people, um... Oh, someone taking a different dog for a walk. Let me go see if Chop's okay. Hey, Chop. How you doing? You doing alright, fella? We made it through the purge this year, so... Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. So I say we go over and check out the, um... What actually was that about? So let's go check... Check it out. Cars piled up in there. That's the play we saw earlier. There's police around. Yeah, what the hell happened here? Car ram. Human lambs are here for some reason. And there is, yeah, police outside or somebody outside the ammunition. Maybe because um, the ammunition could be closed today. Uh, excuse me, gentlemen. But it is closed. Anyway, um, yeah, that building. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I hope you did enjoy today's video. Um, this is something different. This has been the purge inside of GTA 5. I know it probably wasn't as fun as with the other GTA 5 videos, but I hope you did enjoy it. I hope you did enjoy it. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and turn the bell so you can get notified whenever I upload a new video. And yeah, my name's been Billy Marcel 101, and I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye!